of you came, and you know that was the heaviest thing on your heart this weekend. God, I just need a breakthrough. It wasn't for you, you just need a breakthrough for one of your children. So let's all join together, and if you don't happen to have a kid in trouble, then let's pray sincerely and compassionately with those who do. Father, we come to you in that beautiful name that we've been singing about. And I'm reminded that your name is above all other names, and it's above the name of any kind of problem, any kind of addiction, any kind of lostness or emptiness. And we speak the name of Jesus over every family unit that's represented here, and over all the children and grandchildren that are represented here. And we pray for our kids today. We pray for the kids in our nation. We pray for the youth of the world, because they have challenges today that we didn't have 20 and 30 and 40 years ago. And God, I pray that you would raise up and birth spiritual heroes for them, people that they can look to, that have integrity, that are living right lives, and say, I want to be like that. God, help each of us as parents to be those heroes. Help us to be good examples. God, let us never tell them what to do and then find ourselves not doing it ourselves. Forgive us for any mistakes that we've made in raising our children. We know that we're imperfect, and we come into parenthood with our own set of dysfunctions, and it takes us time to heal, and in the process, sometimes we don't do everything just right. But we thank you that you can overcome all of that, and anybody who makes a right choice can have the right life. So I pray for these kids. I pray for sick kids to be healed. I pray for lost children to be saved. I pray for confused children to have peace of mind. I pray that they would find their place in life and their place in society and not wander and waste the years of their life. I pray for those children that are broken and have no confidence and are insecure and don't like who they are and it's crippling the future that you have for them. We take authority over you, Satan. In the name of Jesus, we bind your power. Get off of our kids. Loose them and leave them alone. In the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I thank you that you would open a fresh vial of oil today. And that you would give each parent here a fresh anointing, fresh hope, renewed vision, that they would not see what is, but they would see what can be. And call those things that be not as though they are. And I believe that they will see complete victory in Jesus' name. Let everybody say amen. amen. I love to pray. Last night, 2,143 women gave their life to Christ, are recommitted, are they stepped over from religious to relationship. 2,143. I bet we made that old devil mad last night, amen?